Well, my name is Yvonne Quinn. Um, I'm an owner manager of a small business based in Leicester, which operates nationally. Before I um, came to Barnet, I was with one of the major accountancy firms. Um, I had was dealt with um, a partner who looked after tax, private tax affairs. The idea was that they would give us access to independent financial advice, pension support, tax wrappers, etc., etc., as well as looking after our corporate affairs. It didn't really quite work out like that. I always felt that I was parceled out to somebody who did pensions and somebody who did tax wrappers, and nobody ever really looked at the big picture. So I was, you know, very much in the market for a different kind of service. Barnet Ravenscroft started with taking stock which was very useful basically to say what do you have because whilst everyone sort of knows what assets they have it's not often you really put them down on a list and actually get a, an up-to-date valuation of them and say that's the, you know that is what it is really. Richard it was very nice we talked about the business he then asked some hard and quite challenging questions about how long myself and my husband wanted to carry on working because um, I suppose you tend to just do what you've always done and we've done it for years so that was good because that you know made us think about it and I suppose because we were thinking like that it sort of encouraged us to say okay you know what do we want to do with our time as well you know what other areas if you don't if you've been very busy running a business and suddenly you get to a point where you're probably not having to run it what are you going to do and so that was a really useful exercise to say you know to I suppose develop a vision for the rest of your life really when your children are gone and then maybe so your business is finished, you know, where, what would you like to do with the time you have, really? One of the most surprising things about Barnet Ravenscroft, actually, that they tell you to spend your money, because people don't normally do that, particularly in those. My accountant certainly never said that to me. I was very pleased that Barnet Ravenscroft took that view. So I have sort of thought, well, what, do I, what would I like to do, maybe in terms of holidays and, you know, in terms of setting up my children. My oldest son wants to go into business himself, so one of the things I wanted to do was to be able to provide him with some finance to start up, because that's always hard, uh, as well as advice. I'd also like to be able to you know, buying some property for them. I really feel I've set them up pretty much the way I would like to. I've been very impressed with Barnet Ravenscroft. There is a, a kind of liberation in feeling that things are in order as far as they can be. They're head and shoulders above any other wealth manager or independent financial advisor I've been involved with. I really like their whole life approach and I like the fact that they look at the big picture and they look at, particularly for as someone who owns a small business, they take into account your business assets, your personal assets, your pension assets. I really like the fact that they encourage you to actually set your own goals and your own vision for the future and that they see themselves, I think, as a facilitator to help you achieve that. I actually totally buy into their philosophy, which is passive investment and low management charges. I mean, everything I've read substantiates that and I feel it's in good hands and I do have complete faith in them, really.